hello guys so one question for you have you ever wondered why coconut oil is considered a superfood and also considered healthy compared Sounds to other oils like well in this video i'm going to be sharing with you guys the benefits some of the benefits of coconut oil and also the different ways you can use it in your household so keep on watching <music> My lovelies what's good welcome back to another video if you're new here my name is Chama and I make videos related to lifestyle fashion oh, and glorious. beauty if you're not new and you've been watching me already thank you for coming back I really really appreciate it if you are not subscribed please please can I ask you to subscribe okay it's literally just one click and you're subscribed so please subscribe so you've been and also turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified when I upload a new video which is every Saturday can I make a request guys please 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 could you help me and support me because by the end of this month I want to hit 200 subscribers so please like comment share to your friends and your neighbors and your colleagues at work and your enemies and everybody okay this video was actually requested by one of you guys and so i decided to pull through you know like your girl always does anyways so i'm going to first talk about the benefits of coconut oil and then we're going to move to talk about the ways that you can use coconut oil so the number one benefit of coconut oil is that they contain healthy fatty acids. Fatty acids are components that make up fats and oils and coconut oil contains saturated um, fatty acids. And although normally you would want to avoid saturated um, fatty acids because they're not really good for you, you want to kind of like stick to unsaturated um, fatty acids. But the fatty acids in coconut oil are actually good for you. They are a type of fatty acid that are considered the short chain triglycerides and this short chain triglycerides okay, that's a mouthful this short chain triglycerides get metabolized quickly in the liver because they're not as long as other fatty acid chains so they get metabolized quickly in the liver and get turned into energy quickly and they also um, help to um, promote fat burn. The number two benefit of coconut oil is that it could help to reduce heart disease and also to improve the overall health of your heart. There was a scientific study that was conducted and they found out that people who had a lot of coconut in their diet actually had a very less chance of getting heart disease or any other um, heart you know issues compared to people who do not get as much coconut or coconut oil in their diet number three benefit of coconut oil is that it has antimicrobial properties because of lauric acid lauric acid is an acid that makes up about 50 percent of coconut oil so because of that and it gets um converted into i think monolauric acid or something like that which obviously has the microbial properties that is in coconut so number four benefit of coconut oil is that it's good for the skin and it's good for the hair um, because it hydrates the hair and hydrates the skin and it also acts as a natural sunscreen um, against UV rays and also it's got conditioning properties for the skin and for the hair and especially if you have dry skin you can definitely use coconut oil for hydration and moisture so now I'm going to be talking to you guys about the 10 different ways that you can use coconut oil in your household or around your house. So the first way and most likely the most common way is to use coconut oil for frying or for cooking. So I would recommend if you're going to use coconut oil for frying, you might want to use it for like shallow frying. So let's say like when you just want to brown up some chicken or when you just want to fry some eggs. because it doesn't need a lot of oil unless you have money to buy like tons of um, coconut oil to like fry something like plantain that needs a lot of oil then go for it but if you're trying to save on some money then you might want to just stick to using coconut oil to cook um, and also for like shallow frying 
So the number two way that you can use coconut oil is to use it as a moisturizer. So you can either use it on its own as a moisturizer or you can mix it up with um, other oils or other things to make up a moisturizer or make up a body butter or something like that. I've got a video where I um, made a moisturizer with coconut oil and shea butter and other um, oils. So if you wanna check that out, I'll definitely be leaving a link in the description box for you to check out and um, that's one way that you can use coconut oil so number three you can also use coconut oil to moisturize your hair so I talked about using coconut oil as a moisturizer for your skin you can also use it as a moisturizer for your hair so just put it on your scalp and massage your head and that's good and apparently it kind of helps um, hair grow as well I don't know how I don't know what scientific evidence backs that up but that's what people say but even if it doesn't stimulate hair growth you can just use it as a moisturizer for your hair and just like increase shine in your hair and just have it hydrate your hair still talking about hair you can use coconut oil as a deep conditioner for your hair I've got a video where I made a protein mask with coconut oil and other stuff for my hair and I can tell you it really works wonders it makes your hair so soft and like manageable especially if you've got natural hair but I've got transitioning hair so like my roots are like natural and my ends are like relaxed but it's good for all hair types so if you want you can check that video out again i'll leave it in the description box for you to check out so you know how i talked about how coconut oil has antimicrobial properties well because of that you can use coconut oil as a natural deodorant i don't know how you can use it as a natural deodorant i don't know if you have to just get the coconut oil and just put it all over your armpit or something i don't know but i think a lot of people actually make a deodorant themselves i probably will research that and try making it at home and use it and if it works i'll be sharing with you guys so if you're interested to find out then let me know in the comment section so number six you can use coconut oil as a cuticle cuticle there's a lot of words that i can't pronounce forgive me guys so you can use coconut oil as a cuticle oil so instead of buying a cuticle oil you can use the coconut oil that you have for cooking and for doing other stuff and just put it all over your cuticles and it would just like hydrate it yeah number seven this is one of my best uses of coconut oils using coconut oil as a makeup remover no using coconut oil as an eye makeup remover especially i don't know if you've ever been in that situation where you're trying to take off this waterproof mascara i've got this mascara it's from Ico, and for you to take off that mascara jesus knows like it takes a lot of time you would use micellar water you would use this and use this and use this and it doesn't but coconut oil actually works and i've tried it all you have to do is literally just put it all over your eye maybe with a cotton pad and stuff and just leave it there for i don't know it just works to kind of like dissolving the makeup and just take it off obviously you will have a bit of smudges of um, mascara but it actually works so you should try it another way you can use coconut oil is to use it as a lip balm i've got one here and my lips are dry use it as a lip balm as you can see it gives you a lot of shine although although if you're like me you can lick it off um but it works it's good so yeah you can use coconut oil as a lip balm or you can use it to make an actual lip balm if you don't just want to put it on your lips like like this yeah number nine you can use coconut oil as a massage oil so the same coconut oil that you use for removing your eye makeup that you use for your hair that you rub on your skin the same coconut oil you can also use it as a massage oil this coconut oil that i have here is only lasted me like what five months and it's finished as you can see it's literally finished and it's all the new one um, I used this one, it's called Pimpkin and it's 100% organic raw <laughs> coconut oil. I'll be leaving a link in the description box for you. Um, yeah, so use coconut oil as a massage oil. 
So just warm it up a little bit in the microwave so that it's kind of warm or hot depending on how you want it and then use it to massage your husband or bae or your friend or your mommy or daddy if they need a massage or anyone else it's up to you but yeah you can use coconut oil as a massage oil and last but not the least you can use coconut oil for oil pulling so oil pulling is basically when you put a lot of coconut oil well not a lot when you put some coconut oil in your mouth and you swish 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 swish, swish from bit and then you pour it out so because of the antimicrobial properties that coconut oil has got it can help to reduce gum disease and also help you to avoid tooth decay that's all 10 uses of coconut oil let me know if you want me to make that video about how you can use coconut oil as a natural deodorant and i will go and research that and i will make it and i will share it with you guys because that's what i'm here for okay anyways that's it for this video make sure you check out that video here or here about using coconut oil for your hair or using coconut oil as a moisturizer god bless you see you guys in my next video Bye!